его соперник из Италии. Девятый номер мирового рейтинга, 26 лет итальянцу. Михаил на текущий момент является 15 номером рейтинга, 27 лет. Опытный, чувствительный, динамичный. Встретились два южных темперамента, итальянский и туапсинский. Право налево захват. Поддавливает Михаил. Оба быстро забирают второй захват. И тут же входят в прием. Михаила очень яркая манера такая. Доминирующего захвата. Сейчас пока не демонстрирует ее, но в предыдущих поединках и на предыдущих турнирах мы неоднократно наблюдали, как стоя с прямой спиной, силой рук, силой захвата, сгибает перед собой соперника. Так, показал атаку вперед, выражал с зашагиванием левой ногой и вынудил итальянца и на колени опуститься, и покинуть пределы татами. Так, не было ли здесь запрещенного технического действия с воздействием на локоть стойки? Как мы знаем, по правилам судьбы болевые стойки запрещены. И наказываются с квалификацией. Судейская бригада пересмотрела видео повтор и вынесла решение. Итальянец без претензий подошел. Пожал руку сопернику. И бронза уходит в Италию. Bobanov did one of the biggest throws of the day uh, a, a little bit earlier. Massive Ogoshi, well, Ukigoshi, hit the front hip and then switched it in midair. Buried his opponent. Look at that! Oh, he's done it again! <laughs> Now then! Ippon straight away, opening second there. Morales, Silver Morales went over. Very ever, on. wouldn't it? No, it's, it's a beauty. It. It's, it's a beauty. It. it was an absolute beauty. You know, and, I, uh, and he's not moaning, no, is he? No, no, he knows he's, he's been thumped. The, the funny thing here is to say... What they're trying to do is they're trying to get into top 18. Uh, I mean, yeah, it goes to, uh, yeah, to qualify. To qualify yeah. Solid qualification yeah. position. Here we go then, final. Igolnikov, Kret, Varopeo and Ferreira. I'd be interested to see what happened in that draw, and I'm going to look as well. Who was it that made room? One of the seeds got taken out there early on. They've met once before, these two, and uh, Ivanov was the winner on that occasion. Intelidis has taken a bit of a bump now. So they were in the lower half of the, the draw. Erlan Sherov, the number two seed, got taken out by Alex Kret, who in the quarterfinal fell to uh, 
Salidis. Oh, he's, oh, he's it. got it. Yeah. Oh. He's done it again. He's done it. He just slips in there uh, for that Siatoshi. It doesn't look or feel dangerous. And look at this look. He just slips his hips through. He's on the sleeve and he just push pushes off the back leg there and pulls the arms in. And it's a was hurry up. So the two seeds who were in Pool C both lost before um, Salides got to that point. I knew there was something in there. And then he would have had to fight the winner of Pool D. Yeah, he's had... And, and that was Igolnikov. So he, he's, had to, he's had to go up against one seed. Well, he's, he's, you, you, you got know. lucky with the way that things panned out. It got luck of having um, uh, sorted out Ivan Felipe Silva Morales. It's, it's, it's just the way they work out sometimes. Well, I'll be amazed if he's, he holds on to this for two and a half minutes because uh, I tell you yeah, now, Ivanov's going to absolutely pile on the pressure. Caught him well. Salidis, as Neil just said, two minutes and 20 odd seconds is a long time to hang on. He's already picked up one penalty. Oh, they've oh, taken that, well, that changes the situation as well. Yeah, absolutely, it does. Is, uh... Thundering right arm there of Ivanov. Yeah, he's just got to settle, hasn't he, now? Having given up an early score. Yeah, he's on the defensive here now, Sidilis. So he will get a Shido in a second, won't he, Sidilis? Yeah. He, he took it away a, a couple of seconds ago, he's just give, given it back. Tried it again there, and uh, Ivanov went, no, I don't think so. We're not going for that one again. Yeah, I've seen, I've seen that before. Oh, that's it. That's going to be an Ippon. Ippon scored, and uh, Ivanov... Under a bit of pressure, drops underneath there, Kataguruma, and drives him flat onto his back there, Sedillis. Always good, you know, when they come up with a technique, uh, an Ippon technique, I mean, he had to stay calm, didn't he? Because it, you can easily panic, can't you? You, you, know, you go, wow, well, I'm behind. And we see it with certain athletes. Well, for uh, me, that was yeah. a roll. Uh, well, you know, I, I just, um, I think that uh, if it was in two parts, if... Uh, it might be to do with the arm that uh, assists it over. He's going to he end he up cancelling the hip on and giving a Shido here. Wow. Well, it was. It wasn't. It was the uh, left arm there went uh, deep inside and uh, assisted that, that over. <laughs> and, uh, and he breathes again. <laughs> Sedillas. You could say that uh, there's somebody looking down on him today. Yeah. Look at the uh, elbow there. <laughs> I think it's pretty obvious there, isn't it? It was uh, we were blindsided, didn't see it, just sort of speed, slow it down. You can see the elbow lifting up. Oh, and he's, he's gone, gone over. He's gone over for a second. Was Harry that 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 was that? Was Harry? Yeah, it is. So it, it's all of a sudden it's switched, hasn't it? It's switched over, and uh, from winning. Well, he was in the lead, then he lost it, and now he's just won it again. Wow. <laughs> yeah, that's one that uh, Ivanov is just going to have to suck up and 
and accept. Yes, he will have to look at that, won't he, and say, well, you know, that elbow definitely did assist, without a doubt. 